Now, let us look at the connection between emotions, feelings and moods. Suppose you have applied for some exam and the result comes and you realize that you have not cleared the exam. So, your reaction to that stimuli, the stimuli being the result. So, your reaction will be the basic or the primary emotion. So, that is emotion. And then you go home and you think a little more and you realize that you should have spent a little more time in preparation. You should have put in a little more effort. So then you start feeling some guilt and remorse. So that is a feeling and you are experiencing this feeling, this secondary emotion because of the primary emotion of sadness. And moods are temporary emotional states. For example, some days I wake up and I don't want to study. It, it is not that I am sad. It is just that on that particular day, I don't feel like studying. So that feeling of not wanting to study will go away after some time. So moods are temporary emotional states.